Unlocking your best life, the power of a purposeful vision. Discovering your best life isn't solely about attaining wealth or traditional success. It's a journey intertwined with purpose, especially one aligned with God's intentions. To embark on this meaningful path, you must craft a precise vision that reflects your aspirations in service to a higher purpose. Articulating and actualizing such a vision can be challenging, demanding a deep understanding of oneself and the ability to express ideas with clarity and conviction. Standing against critics and skeptics requires unwavering strength of character. This summary provides insights into the process of creating and nurturing a vision, offering guidance on how to lead a life aligned with your deepest values. Within these insights, you'll also discover 1. The profound significance of bedtime rituals with your children and how it might be the most crucial part of your day. 2. Strategies for dealing with critics and naysayers who may challenge your vision. 3. The importance of making financial sacrifices in pursuit of your noble cause. Visioneering, crafting your life's journey with purpose. Life is indeed a journey, but the quality of that journey depends on whether it's a meandering road trip without direction or a purposeful expedition with a clear destination. If your life resonates with the latter, you might already be a visioneer. Visioneering is the amalgamation of inspiration, conviction, action, determination, and completion. It involves envisioning your future in alignment with God's plan and consistently keeping that vision at the forefront as you navigate life. This intentional approach brings passion, motivation, direction, and purpose to an otherwise chaotic existence. For Christians, visioneering is deeply rooted in understanding that each individual is a product of Christ's vision, designed to contribute uniquely to its realization. Discerning your personal vision, intricately woven into Christ's creative plan, is a crucial aspect of this process. Distinguishing a genuine vision from a passing whim involves identifying what truly breaks your heart. A God-ordained vision feels like a moral imperative, connected to current world issues that resonate with your concern. The key is to pinpoint a concern that you can't ignore and are compelled to address. Once identified, your vision needs time to mature before taking action, and God provides signs indicating when it's ready for implementation. In essence, visioneering transforms life's journey into a purposeful expedition, guided by divine inspiration and fueled by unwavering determination to fulfill God's unique plan for your existence. Faith and Vision – Navigating the Path to Your Calling in the pursuit of your vision, knowing what needs to be done often precedes understanding how to achieve it. Even in moments of slow progress, trust that God has a plan for you and is orchestrating events to bring it to fruition. Success, in the context of your vision, transcends mere material gains or societal recognition. It involves staying committed to your path, relentlessly pursuing your vision, and enduring challenges with unwavering faith in God's plan. True success lies in your dedication to the journey, not in external validations or accolades. Consider the story of Chris, a student with a vision to share the gospel with every student at his school. Despite facing obstacles, such as not having a conventional platform due to his alternative lifestyle, Chris persevered. Unsure of the exact approach, he continued to pray, trust God, and engage with people opportunistically. Chris's encounter with Mark, a troubled student, turned out to be a pivotal moment. Mark, facing personal challenges, became a Christian through Chris's influence, initiating a positive transformation in his life. When Chris left for college, Mark, now a changed individual, was given the opportunity to speak to the entire student body, spreading the message of Jesus and receiving a standing ovation. Chris's vision materialized, every student at Dunwoody High School heard the gospel. The journey unfolded with faith, perseverance, and a series of steps guided by God's plan. This story illustrates that your role in fulfilling a vision may not always be clear, but by taking intentional steps and trusting the process, you contribute to a higher purpose. Vision Casting – Sharing the Blueprint of Your Vision after identifying your vision, praying for guidance, and trusting in God's timing, the next step is vision casting, spreading your vision to inspire others and garner support. 
Vision casting involves using powerful and clear words, as words, according to the Apostle Paul, possess immense influence. The key components of an effective vision include articulating the problem, presenting the solution, explaining the reason for taking action, and emphasizing the urgency of immediate action. Vision casting is about compelling others with your vision, making them see the importance of the cause, and motivating them to commit to it. To effectively sell your solution, you must possess a clear and profound understanding of your vision. Your belief in the necessity of your vision should be so strong that it resonates with your audience on a deep emotional level. Recognize that even seemingly small tasks or visions play a crucial role in the grand design of God's plan. Every action contributes to a larger purpose, and understanding this connection brings a sense of urgency to compel others to join. Vision casting has transformative power. It can initiate movements, alter the trajectory of lives, and influence others in both positive and negative ways. External visions projected onto individuals can also shape the course of their lives. A teacher's encouragement or a parent's bedtime vision casting can have a lasting impact. Bedtime, in particular, serves as a prime opportunity for parents to engage in vision casting with their children. By sharing their vision, solution, and connection to God's purpose, parents can shape their children's perspectives and instill a sense of purpose from an early age. Vision casting, whether done individually or collectively, serves as the foundation for bringing a vision to life and creating a lasting impact on the world. Commitment to your vision, overcoming challenges with faith. Successfully navigating the path of visioneering involves making a commitment to your vision, even in the face of challenges and skepticism. Those who embark on the journey of visioneering commit to their visions before securing the necessary funds, resources, or support. Despite the difficulties that may arise, understanding that your vision is an integral part of glorifying God empowers you to overcome any obstacles. The key message here is, commit to your vision no matter what challenges you face. Financial constraints often pose a significant hurdle on the road to realizing your vision. To accumulate the funds required to serve your vision, you must be prepared to make personal financial sacrifices. This commitment ensures that you are fully invested in your vision, setting the expectation for others to follow suit. The willingness to put 100% effort into your vision is a testament to its significance. Financial challenges are not the only obstacles. Criticism from those who have not embraced your vision can be equally daunting. People may dismiss your vision as unrealistic, outdated, or not worth pursuing. In the face of such criticism, it is crucial to remain steadfast. Giving in to doubt or succumbing to negativity will not propel you toward your goal. Instead, turn to prayer as a source of strength and guidance. Prayer serves as a reminder of the connection between your vision and God's purpose. While some critics may have valid concerns, prayer helps you discern whether adjustments are needed. Flexibility and adaptability are key, as God's plans may unfold in unexpected ways. For instance, if your vision involves establishing a clinic in another country but financial constraints lead you to work at a local clinic, remain open to opportunities that align with God's overarching vision. Embrace flexibility, recognizing that your plan is just one avenue for achieving God's purpose. If you discover even a hint of value in our content, we'd be truly grateful for your support through likes, shares, and subscriptions. It's surprising that 88% of our listeners haven't engaged yet, so I kindly ask for your support. Your comments are not just a guiding star but also the foundation of our progress. Thank you. Now, let's delve back into the review. Fostering unity of purpose, the essential element for vision success. The realization of a vision hinges on more than individual efforts. It requires a collective commitment and unity of purpose. Whether your vision is modest, such as raising a family, or ambitious, like building a school in a remote area, success relies on the unwavering dedication of everyone involved, be it family members, colleagues, or volunteers. The key message here is, Without unity of purpose, visions can't survive. 
As time progresses, it's not uncommon for team members to lose focus or face personal crises that temporarily disrupt their commitment to the vision. Recognizing and addressing these challenges promptly is crucial to maintaining the force field of your vision. Unity of purpose is the glue that holds a vision together, ensuring that all parties involved remain aligned with the overarching goal. Signs of waning commitment include passive-aggressive behavior, talking about the vision negatively, or viewing others' failures as personal successes. Addressing these behaviors head-on is essential, emphasizing that leadership involves inspiration rather than control. Engage in direct and open communication, fostering an environment of trust and collaboration. To become an influential leader, embody inner conviction derived from the knowledge that you are executing God's vision. This moral authority, based on integrity and a deep-rooted sense of purpose, is more impactful than external markers of success. Building and maintaining respect is a continuous process that requires character, sacrifice, and time. A single misstep can erode the hard-earned moral authority, emphasizing the importance of unwavering commitment and ethical conduct in the pursuit of a shared vision. Guarding your vision, overcoming distractions and focusing on God's work. In the biblical account of Nehemiah rebuilding the walls of Jerusalem, when faced with distractions, Nehemiah steadfastly declared, I am doing a great work and I cannot come down. This unwavering commitment serves as a powerful motto for anyone tempted to deviate from their vision. The key message here is, anything that distracts you from your vision is keeping you from doing God's work. Distractions come in various forms, and their potential to lead individuals away from God's plan is a constant threat. Whether it's the allure of success, the pull of unhealthy relationships, or the enticement of fleeting pleasures, Anything that steers you away from your divine purpose is a hindrance to your vision. Three broad categories of distractions include opportunities, criticism, and fear. Opportunities, although seemingly positive, can become detrimental if they divert you from God's intended path. A job with a higher salary may appear enticing, but if it compromises your commitment to God's plan, it becomes a distraction. Criticism, often stemming from a lack of understanding, can be hurtful and challenging to navigate. Staying true to your vision may lead to comments suggesting obsession or misplaced priorities. It's crucial to resist the pressure to conform and maintain a focus on God's purpose. Fear, perhaps the most insidious distraction, has the power to paralyze decision-making. Making choices driven by fear, such as settling for a suboptimal relationship or abandoning entrepreneurial dreams due to fear of failure, hinders the pursuit of God's vision. The antidote to these distractions lies in recognizing that your vision is an integral part of divine purpose. By keeping this perspective at the forefront, you can overcome fear and criticism, paving the way for a life enriched with peace, meaningful relationships, and character. Living a life dedicated to fulfilling God's purpose doesn't require extraordinary bravery, wealth, or talent. Clarity of vision becomes the guiding force that empowers individuals to navigate distractions, ensuring that their focus remains on doing God's work and realizing their divine purpose. Living a purposeful life, navigating challenges and embracing divine vision. The core message of these insights is clear, as creations of an endlessly creative God, individuals are called to utilize their talents and strengths to serve a vision intertwined with divine purpose. The pursuit and unwavering focus on this vision provide life with meaning and fulfillment. Additional actionable advice includes, seek inspirational mentorship. Identify someone in your life who embodies a clear sense of purpose aligned with a godly life. Acknowledge and articulate the ways in which this person manifests vision in their actions. Take the initiative to reach out, schedule a formal meeting, and inquire about the practical steps they undertook to translate their vision into reality. These actionable steps aim to empower individuals in their journey toward a purposeful life, ensuring that their visions are not only recognized but also materialized through deliberate actions and mentorship. By aligning personal aspirations with divine purpose, one can navigate challenges, overcome distractions, and lead a life of profound significance. 
Thank you for returning and staying with us until the end, reflecting your commitment to progress and wisdom. In return, I kindly ask for a small favor. A simple act of liking, sharing, subscribing, and commenting would be immensely appreciated. Your support helps the channel reach a broader audience and, consequently, grow. As a token of gratitude, I'll continue delivering book reviews from some of the most impactful books in the world. Thank you.